Well, Kelly Clarkson of Burleson wows the crowds on the big stage. Many here in Texas remember her before the bright lights and TV cameras. But we wanted to know what she was like before she was famous. Fox 4's Jeff Crilly went to her hometown and brings us Kelly's story. This is the Kelly Clarkson American Idol fans know. But if you want to know the real Kelly, you have to go to Burleson, Texas, far away from the bright lights of the studios. This is Kelly's room. Kelly still lives at home with her mom. Sang, on, there's her keyboard. Where she who says her daughter has been performing since she was old enough to walk. She writes music, too. As a child, Kelly was talkative, to say the least. As she got older, she'd say, Mom, you're not talking. <laughs> and I'd say, you haven't stopped yet. I think it was her attitude. I think her And by the time she was in seventh grade, teachers were already beginning to recognize her star potential. Uh, you know, she, she hang in there. Cindy Glenn was the choir director who first encouraged that little girl with the glasses to perform in front of an audience. Even at 12 years of age, Kelly's voice was amazing. Now, Cindy admits that she's been known to be tough on students, which might have been perfect practice for the critics that Kelly would face on the show. So were you like a seventh grade Simon? Maybe I was. I hope not. <laughs> Maybe nobody will ever sign up for choir again. And as soon as she got a taste for the limelight, during high school, it was one performance after another. Sure, she got tripped up on stage every once in a while. But clearly, a star was born, and everyone knew it. And now that she's among the finalists, the whole town is watching. And everybody's, it's Kelly Knight, it's Kelly Knight. But to some here, she will always be that little girl with the glasses. Only now, she's singing on a much bigger stage. Jeff Crilly, Fox 4 News.